presentation. I just ask you that you reserve it for the for the regular meeting. So any questions just related to the presentation, um, I'd like to entertain a motion to open up to the public at this time. So moved. Second. All in favor? Aye. Anyone wants to come to the, to the microphone and have any questions um, related to anything discussed in the workshop? Yes, sir. You want to come up? Yeah. If you could, for the record, we do have to get your name and address. Thank you. Officers, or you're talking about the 3.9 officers. Either one. Okay. Well, it's it was driven by the CAD report that we requested. Just so you know, when we start one of these evaluations, we send a documentation request to the municipality, and the municipality has to tell us what their budget is, annual reports, calls for service. How much time is spent on each call? And that's the information that we got. So we tried to present it two different ways. What the raw data is telling us, that you only need 1.3 officers, and then what the New Jersey State Police said, based on your population of 2.3 per thousand, you needed 3.9. I erred on the side of 3.9, because I don't think that the 1.3 is an accurate number. They're saying you only need 1.3 police officers to patrol Lake Como. Right, but that's based on the population figure. Population and the calls for service that the police department provided. No. You have, wait, wait, but the calls, the calls for service go up, it becomes a bell curve, but you have class twos that come in and handle those calls to help supplement that. Okay. You say so. <laughs> Any other questions? Yes, ma'am. Allison White of an 1808 Parkway. Um, I just wanted to know if there's any research or what does the research show on the efficacy or the resident satisfaction of contracted officers? And how is that assessed? I don't have any data with regard to that that I can give you. The only thing I can tell you is that, you know, it seems to be an accepted practice contracting police services. They talk about privatizing DPWs. I think somebody talked about that last February 2nd, where you privatize and you send the contract out to get them. So I don't have anything that I could, you know, put my foot down on and say, it's, it's good here or it worked here or it's good someplace else. So I think that, you know, this is going to be a program that we're going to implement. you got to just keep evaluating it over and over again. It's not going to be like, this is the way it's going to be. Every week it becomes, it evolves into something else, a little bit better, a little bit better, a little better, until we fine tune it. Okay. Yes, sir. Tim Petrowski, Closure Drive in Marlboro, New Jersey. I have a question 